So this is going to be literary. We're going to start it at 80. The crime of mail fraud as charged in count one of the indictment has four primary elements which are one the defendant voluntarily and knowingly devised or made up a scheme to defraud another out of money which scheme is described as follows that the defendant from his place of incarceration Florida State Prison advertised and appeared to sell sexual devices which did not in fact exist. Two, the defendant did so knowing full well that the males would be used. Three, that it was reasonably certain that the males would be used. And four, the males were used in furtherance of some essential step in the scheme. This is going to be literary at 100 for one minute. The crime of mail fraud as charged in count one of the indictment has four preliminary elements which are one the defendant voluntarily and knowingly devised or made up a scheme to defraud another out of money which scheme is described as follows that the defendant from his place of incarceration Florida State Prison advertised and appeared to sell sexual devices which did not in fact exist. Two, the defendant did so knowing full well that the males would be used. Three, that it was reasonably certain that the males would be used and four, the males were used in furtherance of some essential step in the scheme. This is literary at 80. The crime of mail fraud as charged in count one of the indictment has four primary elements which are one the defendant voluntarily and knowingly devised or made up a scheme to defraud another out of money which scheme is described as follows that the defendant from his place of incarceration, Florida State Prison, advertised and appeared to sell sexual devices which did not, in fact, exist. Two, the defendant did so knowing full well that the males would be used. Three, that it was reasonably certain that the males would be used and four the males were used in furtherance of some essential step in the scheme this is literary at 60 words per minute
the crime of mail fraud as charged in count one of the indictment has four primary elements which are one the defendant voluntarily and knowingly devised or made up a scheme to defraud another out of money, which scheme is described as follows. That the defendant from his place of incarceration, Florida State Prison, advertised and appeared to sell sexual devices which did not in fact exist. Two, the defendant did so knowing full well that the mails would be used. Three, that it was reasonably certain that the mails would be used and for the mails were used in furtherance of some essential step in the scheme. The phrase scheme to defraud includes any plan or course of action intended to deceive or cheat another out of money. It also means the taking of money from another by means of lies, false impressions, or promises or inferences. A statement of representation is false when it is untrue, when made, or it hides an essential fact. An essential fact is a fact that would be important to a sensible person in deciding whether to engage or not to engage in a certain transaction. To act with intent to defraud means to act knowingly and with the intent to deceive a person for the purpose of causing some money loss to them or bringing about some financial gain to oneself or another to the detriment of a third party. With respect to false statements, the defendant must have known the statements were untrue when made or have made the statement with no thought or caring as to its truth or falsity. In other words, he was completely neutral to that fact.